Did you hear that, the thunder? I don't know if you can hear me over this deafening sound of the rain, but uh, I just got back from a work trip and it's dreary. And I did get something in the mail though that was gonna brighten up my day. And that is a care package from my friend Allison in New Orleans. She sent me some things in the past, um, which you may have seen in my previous videos. But I wanted to go ahead and open this up. She said it was a treat. She was sending me something that only comes out for a few weeks each year. Um, let's go ahead and see what it is. All right, open up the box. It is a delicious, oh, there's actually two of them. Oh, okay. Let's see, make sure you can see that. It says it is Elmer's. And you remember she sent me that big giant uh, box of Elmer's chocolates before. A individually wrapped, let's see, are they the same? They do appear to be the same. Okay, so I can read off this one. It says, individually wrapped a collection of five traditional New Orleans Easter basket treats. And it looks like it's got, well, let's see here. Heavenly hash egg, heavenly hash dark chocolate egg, a pecan egg, gold brick egg. Is that dark, a dark chocolate one and a milk chocolate one? Okay, so calories on the back, huh, let's see, they range between 130 calories for the pecan egg, which is the low one, the rest of them are 160 calories each, so that's not really bad, but let's go ahead and see how big they are, <laughs> this is 5.66 ounces total, let's go ahead and open up the packaging here, I know I never get the lighting right in these videos, so, let's see, oh my gosh, all right, so, thank you, Allison. I really appreciate this. Just so thoughtful. And I don't know, was there a card? Oh, no! <laughs> All right. There we go. All right, sorry. I uh, lost the camera there for a second. It's just sort of balanced up on my dash. All right. Allison sent a card. No, 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 no. As usual, you can't read it. There we go. It says, Michael, as promised, here are the gold brick eggs by Elmer's Chocolate. Hope you enjoy. Happy Easter. So, let's go ahead and pop it open. Here we go. Unboxing. I hope they don't all fall out. All right. They're individually wrapped little eggs. <laughs> I thought there might be some sort of, like, inner holder, but they're just sort of laying in here. So bunch of different ones. I am, okay. Here's the pecan egg. It's much smaller. That's probably why it is lower calories. It's smaller and, uh, well, I don't know. It's small. Okay. Compared to, say, the heavenly hash. I wonder why it's called hash. All right. Here's the dark chocolate gold brick egg. The milk chocolate gold brick egg. Oh, it's a pecan melt away. And this one, this one is the milk chocolate heavenly hash egg. So wait, what was this one? <laughs> this was the gold brick egg. Okay, so many fun ones to try. I don't want to try them all today. So for this video, we'll give this gold brick pecan melt away one a try. How's that? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Wow, they don't want to open these either. Okay, let's try the other side. Uh, oh, it smells good. You can already tell it's a better quality chocolate than like Hershey's. Not to knock Hershey's, but you know, their chocolates are a little... Uh. Now, this is what it looks like. It's a little melted. In fact, it's kind of melting on my fingers. That's probably from sitting out in the Georgia heat of the mailbox. But let's go ahead and give it a shot. Mm. 
It's very good chocolate. I was a little, I was expecting just a little more pecan. I don't know if you can see that. I didn't really get like any in that first bite. Just a little tip of that one piece right there. But, mm. That middle bite was pretty crunchy, so that's good. Mm. Wow. The texture of this chocolate, it's hard to describe. It's, it just melts in your mouth, but not like the Hershey's chocolate melt. It's more like a, oh gosh, I don't even know what you call it. There's something special about this. I'm trying to think, oh, what are they called? Uh, I'm blanking. Uh, I don't know. Those, spe <laughs> those little chocolates. There's something special about southern made chocolates. They just have a different taste. And there's a particular type, something I ate in one of my last videos, and I, I'm blanking on what they're called because I don't ever eat them. Um, oh, but it's just got that sort of sugary, melty quality that's delicious. Anyway, doesn't matter. Mmm. One more bite. Mm. I'm trying to be good, so I'm going to spare you my review on the rest of the products. I'm sure they're going to be fantastic. Elmer's makes good chocolate. You know what? I'm just going to open this pecan one because it's a little different. It's it's not an egg. It's not really a chocolate. It's like a little loaf. So we'll give one more a shot before I go into sugar coma and have to go take a nap. Wow, it's ooey gooey sticky. So let's give this a shot. Wow, when you open it up, it just sort of sticks all to the, the cardboard. <laughs> it might just be all melted to the cardboard, which again, totally not the fault of the manufacturer and definitely not Allison. Allison, they're wonderful, thank you. There we go, let's give this a shot. Is that is that like a marshmallow center? This is called pecan and caramel covered nougat egg. Now, I like the pecans. If I'm completely honest, I don't taste the caramel. Maybe a hint of it. And I don't really like this. Uh, probably because just following that delicious chocolate, there's like no chocolate in this. It's not supposed to have chocolate, but. Mm. There's a reason it's 30 fewer calories. It's probably healthier for you, and that's why I don't want it. It's good, don't get me wrong. I'm going to certainly finish eating this. But if I'm going to have my candy, I want it to eat the chocolate. So, I guess I'm going to go ahead and finish this chocolate. Not now. No, I'm not. Okay. Trying to be good. Trying to do fewer of these candy in the car reviews. Well, that's it for today. I'm going to share these with Tom so that I don't gain another many, many pounds. <laughs> so, till next time, thank you again, Allison. Um, and thank you all for watching. I'll see you around. Take care. All right, I'm back. Simply because I didn't look in the bag. There's definitely more stuff in the bag. I got... I got so excited to open those chocolates. Another little dark chocolate um, gold brick egg, which I think was in here already. Is there not? There it is, yes. So clearly, <laughs> clearly Allison wants me to try this since there's an extra one in the bag. So let me go ahead and open it up. I know, Allison sent me a little message actually letting me know that these were coming. She said, I hope they don't arrive melted. Well, <laughs> they did. <laughs> I'm sure that's not going to affect the taste at all. Oh, I'll start her. Mm. I love dark chocolate. So, I actually like the flavor of this one better. Wow, that is really good. Mm. I love this one, as a matter of fact. And every bite in this one seems to have a lot more of the pecans. 
It's fantastic. So, I'm going to finish eating this off camera just so that I can show you the other thing that was in the bag. Because I don't even know what it is. I haven't seen that yet. It is oh my, more gold brick eggs. <laughs> okay. So, I will definitely try these here soon. Thank you very much again, Allison. And uh, that's it for now, for real this time. So, take care, everybody. See you around.